bamboo is thick and green. The sky is blue and white, and the petal of a rose is yellow and red. But most of all, Lithia Park is the specialist of all. It has the most peace and quiet beauty in nature. The sun is beaming like a big yellow sunflower. The grass is like a sword blade. A bird chirps and sings a song and holds it like a baby in its soft little wings. Nature's peace is a smell of life. The silence is a lullaby. Nature's peace is a song of love. When the sun is bright shining on you, when the leaves are red as lava, you will know nature's peace is here. Ducks, ducks, marvelous ducks. You will see a lot, but you'll never hear them clucks. The owl that lives in a tree, he kept watching me. Staring and staring, glaring and glaring right at me. Fans to catch the wind and rain, to boat along the water, to settle on the land. The ginkgo leaf is its name, it whispers to the wind. The duck comes close, it wants food. It sounds like it's laughing when it quacks. Beads of water cling to its head. It dips under. The water is so clear you can see it down there. It swims over to its friends. Goodbye, duck. Lithia Haiku. I see the turtle. It was posing on the rock to look at the sun. Wind is blowing, I can feel. It is cold, fast, fresh. Water is running, I can feel. It is smooth, strong, wet. I can feel, yet not hold. It is, yet it is not. Wind, water, wind, water. The fog kept coming and coming. Birds are heading south. Animals are moving to their hideouts. Plants are heading for the ground. Willow trees are blowing in the wind. That is November. Thank you. Concrete and bare plants, a red orange tank, paths left and right. I wonder what was here before. So mysterious. Autumn is coming. Autumn is here. You can tell by the leaves all falling to the ground. There are many colors, white, yellow, green, and brown. There is a deer who skips around. A turtle who can soar in the water as well on the ground. A bird tearing through the sky, just hearing a song would make you cry. All of these events are happening everywhere, every day, across the world. Old ashen mills with carts full of grains, pounded and grounded and pounded. Clean and take care of this wonderful park, rake up bags full of leaves. On the grassy knoll, now. He comes closer and closer with his bold spotted chest. I watch silently, but oh great, an itch. I slowly move my hand up to my head, but once I make the slightest movement, he paddles swiftly through the leaves and lost debris from trees. <laughs>